Hi all folks, this is Max from um, Root Amazon Kindle, no, Root KindleFire.com, I forget my site sometimes. Um, so, if you rooted your Kindle, um, you can unroot it back to stock. This is very simple, you can do it on Mac, Linux, or Windows. Connect it to your mm -hmm. Amazon Kindle, and you can disconnect, and make sure under settings, more um, device allow uh, installation of applications on and let's go to our computer next I'm assuming you've rooted um, your um, Kindle using the same computer otherwise you have to install the um, drivers for Windows and also copy over the um, uh, one of the files for ADB to work so if you didn't, then um, go back to, um, you, you can find it on my site at root um, kindlefire.com. You should follow the uh, instructions on how to install the drivers to get ADB working. Um, once you've got those things working, you can download ADB. You'll have a, um, you'll, you'll get the adb.exe for Windows and adb-linux for Linux and ADB-Mac for um, for Mac OS X, and then open up a command prompt. Um, so, open up the command prompt, and uh, hopefully you unzipped it to somewhere where you can CD into it. I unzipped it to my C directory, as you can see here, ADB C directory. Um, so I'm just going to use CD backslash. It's backslash this way. Um, ADB, all right, and I'm gonna do ADB shell for Linux. Um, you'll do ADB dash Linux shell like that, and for Mac, it's gonna be ADB dash Mac shell. All right, so I'm gonna do ADB shell, all right, and you should be able to get into the shell and type SU to um, gain super permissions, super user permissions. And then um, next, what you'll do is type uh, this mount dash shell. I'll have this. You can just copy and paste it. Um, this basically mounts your uh, file system for read and write. And then we're simply going to remove all the super user related files. Rm space um, system um, slash app slash super user dot apk. Exactly like that. You gotta do a uppercase for S. Do that, and then do remove rm slash system slash pin slash su like that, and also rm slash system slash bin um, oops xbin slash su, and type reboot to reboot, and uh, mm -hmm. your Kindle Fire should be unrooted. No traceable elements of super user and root. So I'll be back when this completely reboots to show you that super user app is gone. So my tab rebooted, you can actually check that super user is gone by typing adb shell again and the dot slash adb uh, mac and linux for the other users and type su and you'll say it says permission denied which means um, super user is gone and I can also go on my tablet and show you. And uh, we'll go into our thing here. Yeah, we don't need this anymore. Mm -hmm. And if you go here, more. And if you go to, yeah, not device. If you go to applications, go see all the applications. And you'll see that super user is gone. See? It knows I'm going over super user. So that's how you. Uh oh, what happened? Um, so that's how you unroot um, your Amazon Kindle, your rooted Amazon Kindle. So see y'all later. Subscribe. Um, check out rootkindlefire.com for more cool tips and hacks. See y'all later.